everyone. Welcome in Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah, and it's a yarn haul, y'all. Mm -hmm. I went to Ollie's. Uh, it's a discount store here in the U.S. They do markdowns and discounts and, you know, stuff that be, are closeouts and things like that. And occasionally, they have yarn. This time, they had yarn. But before we get to the actual yarn yarn, show you a couple of other things that I got from there. And there's going to be some pausing and continuing in this one because I, I don't have enough hands. I did find this little guy. It is all of the bits and bits, bits and bobs to make Mickey Mouse. It's a crochet kit. The original retail on it was $14.99 in the U.S., $19.99 in Canada. And um, it was four bucks. Even though it's only four bucks. I thought it was really cute. And I thought it'd be good to put into my giveaway. That's right. I am still having my 500 subscriber giveaway. You still got some time to enter. This is where some of my giveaway stuff is. So that's where it's going to go. So I don't forget. I also picked up some calendar sets. Now these are normally value price. $12.95. No, not at all. It's two bucks. And it's three calendars in each pack. This one is Stunning Views 2022, and it is actually 2022 and 2023. This is a two-year planner. There's an address book. There's a 16-month calendar of the small one, and the big one is also 16 months. Stunning views with all kinds of pretty views of sunsets and sunrises and all kinds of beach scenes and stuff. This one is similar in what it's got with it, only this one is Flowers. This is a large print one, which gives you more places to write your stuff in. And it's all floral. And this one also is a large print one like that. Also has the same bits and bobs with the extra little calendars and a dress book. And it's watercolor. And I just thought they were really pretty. And yes, they will probably end up in giveaways as well. Because they're really cool. First bag. First bag. Of yarn. Let's start with some of the weirder stuff. Not really weird, I guess. Uh, a Caron One Pounder in Limeade. This was the only color they had in the Caron One Pounders, but this will be good for all kinds of different fodder. I, it's not something, a color that I would wear, but it is a color that I could use for a lot of different things, and this will go a long way. It was $4. Okay. This is a Caron Jumbo. Also four bucks, 340 grams, uh, 544 meters. And this color is Gossamer. That's pretty true to color there. It's got a purple in there, a light blue, an orange, white. Yeah, I think that'll be pretty cool. They're, they're four weight, usual care on stuff. Let's see if there's anything else weird in this bag. No, okay. This is weird in and of itself. I picked it up because why not? Bernat or Bernay. Ali's Easy Wool. They were $2.99 a piece. Each one is 150 grams and it says that it's 10 meters. Um, it's 54% acrylic, 24% nylon, 20% wool, and 20% polyester. Look at that. It's loops all put together. And when I say put together, I'm not even kidding. You see that? There's a thread in between that connects all of this and it shows this project um, on the label easy wool seed stitch scarf it says and it takes four balls for that so i bought four i might give this away i don't know these are all in the color cream or crema they're soft they really are i was really surprised by looking at it as to how soft it would be oh here you can get a better view of what this is I personally think that you can go in and get this thread out from in between, snip, 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 and have a lot, a lot of this sort of tubular knit fabric. Not really fabric, I guess yarn. Almost like chain stitched yarn. Oops, one down, okay. Back in the bag you go, on the bed you go. A bag number two. Oh, this one's a big one. So, all right, I'll start with two that I actually already own because I know where they're going. These are Woolies Thick and Quick, buck 99 in the color Blue J. These are Lion Brand, 80% acrylic, 20% wool, and um, 87 yards, 80 meters. 
there are 140 grams that is the color and these are super quick to make hats in and stuff i have some others over here in my cubes which is why i picked that up because i'll probably make more hats with them when that time comes around speaking of hats uh gary from urban yarn is going to have a crochet along or knit along it's a make along because you can do crochet or knit for his bush tracker beanie and i thought that would be cool in these colors very pretty blue this is these are all heat wave yarn which i'm not sure if that'd be too warm here in georgia or not as you see i've got my big sweater on today it's 60 degrees in the house so yeah a little bit chilly uh these two are called water park and this one is called blue skies i just thought they were super pretty each one of these is 2.99 um still cheaper than you know buying the regular retail but I think those will be pretty together. Don't know if I'll do the hat with this. These are not, but I just, I was really drawn to the colors. They're really pretty sort of light blues. They look almost spring-like despite it being heat wave yarn. Oh gosh, I'm going to make a mess on the bed with all this yarn. Okay. And there's more heat wave because once I started, I couldn't stop. Um, this is in the color beach bag. Strange names for a yarn that is like designed to be worn in the winter time, right? But boy, that is a pretty, pretty purple. I like purple. Okay, putting those up there as well because I don't know where they're all going in my cubes yet. And, oh yeah, I got a bunch of these. I don't like buying just one of something in case I want to do a bigger project. Yeah. This is the same girl who went into a dollar tree one time and bought $80 worth of yarn there. Um, look at that. There's sparkle. This is Caron Simply Soft Party. These are all in the colorway Black Sparkle. And yes, it is. That is black and that is sparkle. And gosh, it is really soft too. These are a four medium weight, 99% acrylic, 1% metallic, 85 grams, 150 meters. And I think I'll have enough to do some stuff with with five of these suckers on the bed you go okay oh my goodness yeah speaking of five of things why i was picking five of things i don't know but that's what i did and no i didn't take everything there was actually a lot there i was surprised <laughs> five <laughs> found these on an end cap i was like more yarn yeah, I'm kind of crazy to shop with sometimes. Uh, these are all Caron Skinny Cakes. These are No Wool, Sin Lana. Okay, sorry, I'm reading the label in other places. They are 100% acrylic, 250 grams, 727 meters. They're a three weight. They're a three light, and I would agree with that. They are on the light side of a three as well. Uh, this is the color Citron Fizz, and all of these are the same. I don't know what I'm doing with this yet. I think they would make an awesome corner-to-corner -corner blanket, but I think that about these, about any of the Caron cakes or any of the ombres or anything, I just think that looks cool. But yeah, they are all the same colorway. All five of them. Oh, wow. My bed is covered in yarn. Yay. And finally... And this part is uh, five more of a same color way. <laughs> Don't know why I'm buying things in fives. It just doesn't make any sense to you. It doesn't make any sense to me either. Oh, yarn down. Okay. And I'm dropping it. It is more Caron Simply Soft in parte. This is a pretty green with a green sparkly bit running through it. I really like that. What are they calling this one? They're calling it upside down. Dark Sage Sparkle. Whatever. It's a pretty green with a pretty green sparkle. Ooh. Five of them. Five. Yeah. It's a lot of yarn. Not sure where I'm putting it. I better get to crocheting and giving away. So there is that because there will be 
another little haul video coming up soon as well from another place. <laughs> Stop me before I shop again. Anyway, have you bought any new yarn lately? What'd you think of my little haul from Ollie's? I thought it was pretty cool. I really love the colors in the heat wave. I'm nervous about wearing heat wave. So if I make it, I might end up just donating it somewhere. Um, but yeah, the, I think the care on one pounder, that, that green color, that'll come in handy. It may end up in next year's crochet over 2020 blanket in parts. Who knows? But it was fun. And, uh, little Mickey Mouse thing added to my giveaway pile. Plus maybe some of this yarn will end up in that giveaway as well. I still haven't chosen my box that I'm sending it out in yet. So we'll see. We'll have to see what I can shove in there. Uh, if you haven't entered that yet, do it. What are you waiting for? Just make sure you watch the video all the way to the end so you get your instructions and do it correctly. Thank you. Check the description for more information and details. And um, I will see you very soon, I hope. Bye now.